getting ready to uh, paint this old van, uh, the roof that is, and uh, as you can see the ambient air temperature is uh, 102 degrees, 103 now. It's 3.38 in the afternoon on Saturday, the September 5th. Okay, now let's look at the actual surface temperature of this black colored van. I'm going to use a laser pointer here. It's coming up uh, 145 degrees. 145.4 degrees. It's pretty hot. Let's see if we get a different temperature in a different part of the roof. comes up uh, 144, so about 144 degrees. Here's another temperature reading toward the center of the roof. That's coming up 150.5. Now I'm planning to paint this uh, old van roof with hyperglass cool top coat uh, that uh, contains tiny glass microglobules that are the most reflective, creates the most reflective surface uh, ever measured. And uh, my prediction is that after I put on a couple coats of this stuff, the uh, roof now that's been measuring 150 degrees or so, 145 to 150, will uh, be cooler. So let's give it a try. We're rolling on the first coat. It's 10% uh, water. Rolls on pretty smooth. Make coverage. Okay, as you can see, it's now four fifty seven PM nine on uh, September fifth. And the air temperature is 97 degrees, a little cooler. This is our white roof. Let's try it back here. A little warmer back there, it was 80 degrees. That's half, half the surface temperature. And if we try the front of the car here. Okay, 458, 120. 120 degrees on the front of the car and 85.9 in the front where it's facing the sun. Now you can see the uh, finished product. That roof that was actually steaming when I put uh, water on it earlier to clean it off is now cool to the touch.